Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Go, 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 go. Don't even look, don't even look. Fuck this. Go, 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 go. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, Noisy Boy here, and welcome back to the channel. In today's Red Dead video, we're going to be continuing on. Next quest is going to be for Dutch, but I did mention in the last episode that after that little debacle that went on inside St. Denise being set up by Bronte, I have a feeling that Dutch will not let this go at all. I'm apparently robbing a bank. The quest is actually called... A country pursuits pursuits so I guess let's get it going but before we get started guys remember if you are enjoying the series so far remember to quick join that like button to support my channel and if you're new feel free to subscribe because I love to hear your feedback and your comments in the comment section below let's get it on let's see what he has to say for me so Arthur you get the deciding vote by what we take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches. I told you. Deal with business the right way. We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. Just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Before the year is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Farmers. But we need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. Trust me. Arthur. If it's business, well, business is business. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Arthur, come on. You better be right about this one. I am. I have to... I have to talk, you know. If you say so. Quit now, Arthur. It does no favors. Come on. We need to go see a man about a boat. But you know, I think he really wants to just... He does want to rob the bank, I know that much. We're headed to a settlement called Le Grand. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why do we need a boat? So we can attack Grante's mansion from the swamp. Catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See? I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, Arthur. Oh, well, before we get going. Actually, we probably don't need to. Okay, follow me. It's like I was saying before, I think he wants revenge, but I think he's trying to kill two birds with one stone, trying to rob this bank, obviously, but as well try to take on Bronte, but taking my side back there. It ain't about sides. Feels like Jose has lost his spine. This move on Bronte, is it for the bank job or revenge for what happened at the trolley station? Both. Neither. What does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also Set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. We just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made 
than what it takes to support 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? You tell me, Orson. Is it? Have some goddamn faith. I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. I know, but... But, 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 when did you become so small-minded? If you'd rather we break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together, working together to get out together, or we're not. There simply isn't a reality in which we do nothing and get everything. I know. You're right. This feels like we're on borrowed time again. I mean, the old Driscoll's found us. Anyway, here we are. Let me do the talking. Jeez. I just feel as if he's really lost the plot. Like, it doesn't sound like he's in for the, for the bank job, it sounds like he's in for the revenge. Dude, good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's gonna help us get close to our prey. The other night we had quite... He's got a bun eye, does he? For ...catfish. Now, my friend... Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. If anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you're bringing him trouble, there won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Why not? Check the traps. Oh, fuck, how many gators in there? All right, I guess checking traps it is. Mind if there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number, big ones. Great. Oh, oh now, fuck. Arthur, it'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a. An agent predator with a big mouth, Dutch. Here <laughs> is something of a comedian, Thomas, more of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, if you say so, Mr. Dutch. This way. Come on, this way. Follow me here. And stay on the high ground. Well, I'm gonna stay behind you, that's for sure. Like water to make. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. Okay, well, this is walking straight. Nope. Fuck that. Does anyone else just see that water move? Like, do you see those eyes up the back there? Yeah, what the fuck, man. There's something moving in there. This one's empty. Alright, I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going out to Angelo Brunton? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Oh, fuck, what is that? Stay close. Make sure you follow my line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. The Mr. fuck is that? You can see why even swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peaceful. Nobody bothering you now. Except for the night folk sometimes. Night folk? Night folk? Yep, some strange people around these parts. Wider than the animals they are. Well, this just gets better and better. Night folk? I've... I've come across them before. Fucking tough as a fucking tougher as nails. Took me a whole clip of my semi-automatic to put one of them down. Stop where you are. It's a gator. Just as still as you can. What the fuck? 
fuck. Why did I come here? Yeah. It's probably fucking gator food. Oh man, fuck this, bro. Be death rolled by a gator. Oh, fuck that. Get that thing out of here. Oh, tore it in half. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was. No, but only some huge could do this. Fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. <laughs> Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. Alright. I suppose just can wait. Let's go. Man, it is pissing down raining outside my house right now. Gotta love it. Okay, so there is a super big gator out here. You yeah, know, fuck that. I'm standing behind this guy. Two of them. Three of them. Oh my god, where are they going? Don't come this way, please. My Good gators. Good evening. Us or that? Exactly. Come on. Well, three of them went that way, so that's fine. I'm happy with that. I'm gonna stay right behind this guy. I ain't not fucking going off by myself. Fuck that. We really should have run into jewels by now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. Oh, really? so at home here, you take the right. We'll go left. Oh. Just keep your eyes open. Are you guys fucking kidding me? Yeah, let's split up. That's a good idea. Where's my gun? Actually, no, let's uh, get you back out. Fuck, man. That's a, such a good idea. Of course I have to go off by myself. If there's a gate here, I'm so fucked. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide, nowhere even to jump up to. Like, climb a tree or some shit. Oh. What would my luck be like if that big fucking thing he was just talking about is at my side? I bet you any money it is. Jules. Hey! Someone there! Well, if I can make it to that island, I should be fine. Actually, if I go to that middle part there, I think I should be alright. No. This motherfucker ain't here. Jules. Well, I don't see shit. I feel pretty safe on these islands, I don't want to go in the water. Use. Hey! Someone there! Here! Help! That must Where? be him. Oh, yep, okay, yep. He's up in the tree. Why am I going into the water? He's up there, look at him. Hey, you in the tree. What are you do? 
I don't care. The cannon. Yay! That makes me so happy. Don't worry, man. I'm going. Oh, thank fuck. Thank God, I'm right, Jesus. So, uh, who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry. Oh. Now, boy, I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we clear. You gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Hey, yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. Yeah, fuck that. You'll see any giant must <laughs> long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple of crack gunslingers here, but the gun's loaded. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Come on, put your back into it. Good stuff. Oh! Jules? Shit. He won't kill No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Arthur will go. Well? What? Go on, Arthur. Twig. <laughs> Tomorrow I'm coming, man. But fuck, if there's something there, I'm gonna leave you behind, son. Blow you away. I'm coming. Oh my god, look at that wave. Oh. Where go? The fuck did he go? Shut up. Oh hell, how did he get down there so quickly? I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming, kid. I'm coming, Jules. I get you, Sim. There's a boat, there's a fucking boat. Oh, God, no. Go, 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 go. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Go, 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 go. Don't even look, don't even look. Fuck this. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. go. Oh, fuck, dude. Just get in the fucking boat. I can hear it coming in my, in my ear. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fucking go, go, go. Go go go! Put him here, come on! Bit quicker than that, Arthur. Oh, 
fucking go get up there. Oh god. Hey, you're on down, you big son of a bitch. You take this, you fucking asshole. Yeah, take this, you fucking asshole. Oh my god, look at this. Fuck, look how big it is. I think he's got a shit down his one big old gate. Oh, your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop bleeding. Holy god damn. <laughs> Don't screw around fast, all you gotta do. Just relax, man. A lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. Gotcha, buddy. I stopped the blade. I think you'll be okay if he don't get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. What the fuck is that? Look who's back. God damn it. What? Take that, you fucking asshole. Fuck it, dude. God, I need some more fucking. Okay, I think it's had enough. Now, Jesus, we get back now. Uh. Fuck! I unloaded okay. two, oh, two and a half Jules. clips on that son of a bitch. He never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think <laughs> I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Uh, Jules has been bitten. Uh, oh, my God. There's a monster out here. Uh, he's been bitten, but he's alive. Uh, Just keep him warm. <clears throat> Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? Just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Bronte. Bad man. I don't know. Killed some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. But he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. Be safe. Got monsters, I think. Well. Holy fucking god damn, what the fuck was that? That was definitely something else. Hey, what's going on? Oh, mission complete. Country pursuits. Well, let's have a look at that. Got a silver for it, not bad. Return jewels to the skiff within a minute and 40 seconds. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? They call it the Bull Gator. Oh my god, fuck that. You yeah, fuck that, man. Like, honestly, you see the size of that fucking thing? Looks like I got myself another child's one. Still gotta do this one as well. That's obviously where the bounty is. I wonder if there's anything else. I don't think there is. Oh, I still got this one to do. Fuck, this was sitting there for ages. Alright, alright, we're gonna stick with Dutch, I guess. Dutch Vanderlyn. Have a look at time, 24 minutes. Well, we might as well just wrap this one up here. It's probably a good time to wrap it up, but 
Man, I was fucking shitting my pants when it came to that fucking gator out of the out in the bayou there. Fuck that shit. Well anyway guys, if you did enjoy that and you did enjoy the fact that I was sweating there a little bit, remember to quick draw on that like button and support my channel and if you're new, feel free to subscribe because I love to hear your feedback and your comments in the comment section below. I am your host Noisy Boy. Thanks for coming on by, and as always guys, stay noisy.